cool thing here I said a big increase if you go check out last month compared to this month in the other marketplaces my sales are starting to increase merch by amazon income report for the month of april all right let's break down how much i made in royalties my advertising costs all that fun stuff check out the top selling design how much that design let's check out the top three right if you guys get any value out of this video make sure you give it a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed to my channel subscribe to my channel any comments related to you know my royalties or my advertising you're more than welcome to ask down below in the comments Let's get into the content. All right, guys. So I'm in the back end right here. I went over here, so I'm on Pretty Merch, right? Um, if you guys are underwear, Pretty Merch, freaking awesome tool to help you look at your 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 data and your analytics and your sales for the day and stuff like that. Creates a really awesome dashboard and helps you analyze things so much easier, right? Because you need those, you need that, right? You need those when you're up in the, you know, you're up in the you're up in the higher tiers, man, or you're just understanding your data and you want to learn more about your data and how, what's making money and what's what niches are making money for you, right? So analytics, gonna go to previous month. I'm gonna go ahead and click on United Kingdom, Germany, France, Italy, Spain, and Japan. And then I'm gonna press analyze sales. Okay, it's gonna gather all my information from, you know, all last month. So analytics from April, 2021. Okay, this is real, this is not fake. Um, don't try this at home, I'm just kidding. Analytics for April, 2021. Okay, where is, where's the best day at? I think it was right here on the 8th yeah i believe it was the 8th the 8th was the best day 344 in royalties okay as we come down 2153 sales us okay us market seven thousand three hundred and fifty one dollars now this right here okay this is getting me mad okay it's not gonna be mad but it's been like last month it was above four dollars i am still trying to get this up above four dollars right um i've been putting all my new shirts at like you know 1999 1995 1997 1996 it all depends how i feel that day but i'm just trying to get it above a five dollar royalty but you know as of my account and how big it is right i'm at two uh 200 k tier so it i have designs from night or nine or nine 2020 right or or 20 or 2019 okay um, 2018 that are still priced, you know, 16.99, 17.99. I'm still trying to get those back up to 19.99 because we go into different months. As out before, I used to tack certain trends, and now just more like evergreen niches and building out niches. That's what this is the issue that I'm running into, guys. Okay, cool thing here. I said a big increase. If you go check out last month compared to this month in the other marketplaces, my sales are starting to increase. Okay, you see the returns right here. That's normal, guys. That's normal. Okay, don't don't get be, don't be afraid of this. It's normal. Um, but this right here is going to be amazing because I believe in Q, heading into Q4. There's no reason why these other marketplaces that are doing over a hundred dollars right now. These are creep, these are getting up there, right? They're getting up there. Okay, Japan. If I make a sale in Japan, it's a good damn day. All right, I know that. <laughs> you know what I mean. So if I make a sale in Japan, it's a, it's going to be a good day. Okay, just for just the rest of the marketplaces in general. But my goal is going into Q4 is average a thousand dollars a month in you know in the different marketplaces, right? Um, I, I believe and I definitely like from what I'm looking at and seeing, see I need to get the yeah, I'm just testing a few things over here in these other marketplaces. I need to get these up right here. But from my understanding and from what I can see, these are definitely gonna be doing over a thousand. These three marketplaces for sure. But the goal is to get all those other marketplaces to do over a thousand. You know what I mean? You can see it, but I believe they will because if the numbers right now going into Q4 should be a little bit higher. Like there's no reason within three months, this shouldn't be doing over 300 or $400 a month, these two marketplaces, and these should be doing over 100, 200. But then when we go into Q4, I can see this one definitely doing over a thousand, this marketplace, the UK, and then Germany doing over a thousand dollars for sure. These ones, I don't want to say, but looking like 600 to $700 a month by the time we get into Q4. But the, we're shooting for one thousand dollars a month right and also to the conversion rate you know it's a little bit higher compared to usd i think it is so like if you search this right here this would be probably close to two hundred dollars right all right enough of that but yeah really awesome month you can see i need to get this up some notes for me to take personally myself and for you watching this you can see that, that big impact right the big difference let's say if i would have had this closer to four dollars it would have been over eight thousand dollars in royalties right and what it did, you know, five dollars even better. It'd be closer to ten thousand. So you can see it makes a, you know, a easy. You know, it can be anywhere from seven hundred to almost three thousand dollar difference, right? By adjusting the prices. So something to think about. You know, ninety-two percent of my sales come from the U.S. As you can see up here, 
And let's go down. Average uh, sales per day, 72, four to five uh, returns per day. Okay, that's really cool. Average per month, cool, cool. Down. Now, uh, with my product, the products that I focus on the most are standard t-shirts. Tank tops are starting to do well during the summertime, right? People are wearing tank tops, so there's a little bit of an increase. Something to think about as you're going in and, and designing and, and uploading to other products. Test it out on a tank top and see if it works, right? People love to wear tank tops during the summertime, going to the beach, anything like that, okay? Anything with tank tops do really well because, yeah, summertime. They wanted to the snug. The sun, was it? <laughs> people want to show their guns, right? A horrible joke I was going to say right there, but I messed it up. Um, people want to show their guns and uh, once they're, they're going to the beach and stuff like that, right? So uh, the top fits, you men, men's, go on, adding our hair a little bit more. Okay, I focus on standard t-shirts. If you guys are unaware of that, I talk about it all the time. I just upload to one product and then if I see it doing well, I'll start to upload to the other products. But I, I believe that, you know, each, it depends. Like I can't, my, my design on a standard t-shirt work, won't work on a uh, pop socket, right? It may work on a V-neck. It may work on a pullover uh, hoodie sweatshirt. But for the most part, I just focus more on this because this is 90%, like this is like overall, like 90% of my account. And this is where I make all my sales at, right? But when you make a hoodie, um, I mean, when you pull over a hoodie and you get a royalty of 10 bucks, whew, take that all day, right? All right, now, so top fits, that's enough of that. Uh, men, okay, 1,100 women, over 700 kids, 250 units, 6, 30. Top selling colors, black, white, the white, the, dude, this, like, this is, like, before I wasn't uploading to white, and it's, like, the second best color, okay? Don't, just be, okay, if you can make it look good on a black t-shirt and it's like a let's say it's an all white design it's a little switch on right on, on 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 your design and you can switch it over to an all black design and it'll look good on a white shirt just a heads up okay very simple you can see my top selling products for the month top selling colors for the month so on and so forth as we come down here my number one design uh, 175 sales almost 900 dollars from royalties crushing it this is right here is in uh, japanese I think it's Japanese yen, if I said that correctly. So those does just one sell, one sell. Um, second design, $312 in royalties. Third design, $264.69 in royalties. And then as you go down, you can see. Freaking amazing, really awesome opportunity, guys. If you guys are unaware of what Merch by Amazon is, I make a ton of content on it to help other people. Make sure you guys give this a thumbs up. If you get any value out of this, I am going to go into the Amazon advertising and uh, let's see what's let's see what's up with these ads. See how much I spent and see how much the total profit I got for the month of April. All right, guys. So I'm in the back of my Amazon advertising for the U.S. I actually ran started running ads to other marketplaces last month and I started seeing some good results. And there's a few people ask me questions. When do you get access to it? I do not know. I've been asking and trying to, you know, you know, research and find, see if I can find anything. Have gotten no information on that. I know a few people sent an email to Merch by Amazon and some of them don't know. It just seems like the responses are automated. And then, yeah, I, I only thing I could recommend is just get into the higher tiers. Try to get into the higher tiers so you can get access to it. All right, now you're gonna see right here, some people asked me too as well. Last video, seven campaigns, almost, you know, almost or completely out of budget. Okay, it's some of these campaigns as I, you know, increase like the daily women and stuff on them. They will go out of basically, they will go out of, you know, out of budget. And I will, I, I raise them based on, you know, my, um, my data and stuff, what I'm reading, like my A cost and stuff like that. Or, or it depends like how aggressive I want to be with that design because I know that it's, you know, organically ranking really well. Okay, it all depends. So, Understand that it's important that you know how to read your analytics, your data that you're receiving. Everyone's different. Everyone has a different goal. So mine, my way I approach this might not work for you, but I can help you understand what you're doing because based on what you want, how you want to approach this, you may have a different goal, right? And this is why I'm making, showing that you guys this, this, this information on the back end to kind of help you out. Okay. Uh, in the U S I spent $2,930.32. My A costs around 19%. Okay, that's just the overall. Remember, guys, some of the ads in there are, you know, 12%, 13%, 19%. As you can see, like in the right hand count, 11%, 51%. What the heck is going on with that one? So 
I'll definitely go back this week. It's more of a weekly thing too as well, guys, if you're kind of optimizing everything. You can check this like every week or every two weeks. The more data, the better, right, of course. And then of course, at launching new ads and stuff like that. It can also shoot up the aid cost a little bit more, also shoot it down. 783 orders, really good month, okay? You're gonna see like so my top campaign. Let's say design my top campaign, $93, second one, 92, third one, 92. This one is interesting right here because this is the older one and I brought it back. I revived it, right? And it's ranking good again. This happened back in the day when they wiped all of our ASINs and completely wiped them. And I was mad and everyone was mad and everyone was complaining about it. I finally brought it back and it's now it's making consistent sales again and it's ranking really good. And I think this is really cool. You're going to see like, as you look in here, You'll see some, that's where I said, look at the eight costs and some like this one is weird. Some days are, some days are weird. Some days are like, you know what I mean? Like this one, the eight cost is 38%. It shot all the way up. Okay. Um, and then I'm messing with, you know, with some of the daily budgets, as you can see, because I start to spend a little bit more and then like the eight cost, some of the days are, they're really amazing. And then some days are just whoop, all the way up. I'm like, dude, what the heck? Let's see what the best day for sales so let's see right here, 700, $761 dollars in sales. Okay, that's pretty good. That's a good day, spend $85, take that all day. All right, as you, it, it, this, this, see this is a more of like a, when you start to learn this stuff, you wanna figure out like, okay, certain, like how can you, you know, turn up your, your targeting, like you're targeting your bids to increase, you know, your sales. Like, so if you're at a, let's say you're at a 15% a cost, right? And you're willing to risk 20% a cost, right? So you'll give up 5%. Would you turn up your bid a little bit more? You know what I mean? So would you turn up the bid a little bit more just to risk a little bit more of a cost to help you rank more and get more sales, right? Or sometimes you, you, you have a, a search term that's killing your campaign. Well, you're gonna have to do turn that into a negative keyword, right? And that will kind of help optimize a little bit better. And sometimes by you doing that can make all the difference and increase the sales volume for that shirt design, or it may be a sucky campaign, right? You may have to just lower the bid and, you know, cause it's not doing so well. The eight cost is 30%, 40%. It's not doing nothing at all. So let's calculate this. Come over here. We're over here calculating the U S number. So 70, 73 minus bring up that calculator boom we're at four thousand four hundred and twenty one dollars and sixty one cents all right so that's the profit for the u.s now of course i'm adding in like the uk and all that stuff we'll talk about that but i'm not going to go into more detail i'm doing that because it'll take a little bit longer to you know finish this video so i'm not gonna talk about that but i'm gonna show you the results that i'm getting over there and I'm going to blur out some of the stuff too. Just be aware, guys. So in different countries, if you look at the different countries, you look at the little tab up here, you're going to see uh, .amazon.co. So the UK, you know, you're going to see Germany, France, Italy, you know, um, so on and so forth, right? So as I come over here into the different marketplaces, you're going to see, so like over here in the UK, you know, $61 in euros, it costs around 17%, okay? Now, this is still a testing phase for me. Okay, this is from last month. This is pretty good, okay? As I start to analyze a lot of this stuff, I'm trying to figure out, okay, I wanna see some consistency, and I'm starting to see more consistency, right? And with the A cost like that, that's amazing, okay? In the US, I think I did 19%, right, for last month, but this one's at 17, you know, 17 cents. So you can see that there's very little competition over here. If I start running sales within the first month, start making a decent amount of sales and have a decent amount of uh, a cost. Now you go over here and compare it. So that's like three X, right? Pretty good. Okay. Compared to, you know, just looking at that 177 euros, right? I spent that much, right? I spent that much on ads. So that's pretty good. That's a, you're winning double more than double, double, almost three X. Okay. Then you come over to the other marketplace. We're at 12% a cost. Now you can see like, and <laughs> so when you're coming over here to set up other marketplaces, right? And set up your campaigns, it's important that you understand 
that it's going to be in a whole different language. <laughs> so it's going to be, you got to figure out, okay, so based off like the, if you go to the UK, it's in English, right? I can kind of just look and, and snoop around and like, okay, cool. The tab right here for last month is three spots up. And then I can come over here and to the ger in German and, 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 and I can go three spots up and I know that's last month. And then when you're creating these campaigns too, as well, apply that same, that same rule. If you know how to, you know, put your credit card information and do all that stuff, make sure you apply the same rule to this. Okay. So 58 euros, right? Uh, 12% come over here. I'm at 124. Ah, good. Decent. Take it. Okay. Of course, I'm going to go in here and optimize this a little bit more. And, you know, figure out, you know, these average royalties and get this up a little bit, you know, which, yeah, I need to I'll definitely get that up because I'm not going to be hanging out over here doing this $3 royalty stuff no more. And you can see it's pretty good. So now let's go over here to France. We're at 13%, right? Spend $13, 13, I mean, 13 euros, right? Come over here. We're doing good. We're looking smooth, looking real nice. All right. Now, Italy. Dang. There's, it's killing me over here, right? It's definitely not in the profit, right? As you can see, we're at almost 50% ACOS. And uh, that's interesting, right? So I don't, I'm not going to panic about this. I'm going to let this run for a few more months because I want to figure out what's going on. But I definitely need to come in here and do some uh, negative targeting for my understanding. Yeah, because it's not, it's not doing so well. So I need to figure out what do I need to do, right? And we have about 17 orders for last month. Okay. Um, but as you compare it from, it's definitely not in the profit from my understanding. Right. So it's a, it's a very high a cost. I need to fix that spending more money on ads than making the sales. Okay. So this is something to, this is something that's very important that you, I want you guys to understand just because you see this and it's not doing well, don't panic, hang in there, hang in there. You need to, you got the data in front of you. That is everything. It's the knowledge is everything that you need to understand you need to go back in here figure out what the heck's going on with this and fix this bad boy because there's money to be made over here and you need to you need to dial in on it right so don't freak out okay now let's come over here to spain as you can see i'm coming over and checking the different marketplaces i lose control i lose uh i forget all these marketplaces that we're in so it's something that you got to keep in mind too when we're doing all this right 32 percent right not too bad not too bad royalties okay it was 48 dollars 48 dollar 48 euros right but i'm spending more money on ads and it's it's right there though you know what i mean it's right there maybe the audience is different it's right it's almost there it's it's, it's i just need to optimize a little bit more to bring it down but it's it's right there so the a cost is not that high compared to over here almost 50 percent right so it's decent it's get it's ranking i'm testing you can't run ads to japan yet but something to think about right when you're going back and forth and looking at all this stuff so some some insight right there hopefully that helped you make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up check out my other video here peace out